Welcome, welcome to helpviavideo.com. Today, on today's uh, video, I'm going to teach you how to remotely access your home PC from anywhere on the internet. Uh, I found the easiest way to do this is to use a website called logmein.com. And so today we are going to go there and um, and create an account and set it up so that we can log in remotely into our home PC. We're going to go to uh, get started from their logmein.com homepage. And we're going to choose the logmein free remote control only. And we're going to sign up. I want I just want to see what happens if we click on free here. Same thing. Okay. My email address is log me in at help via video dot com. Gonna enter my password. I'm not from the US, I'm from Canada, so I will be entering uh, Canada in. It's personal use, and I want to uncheck this here because I don't want to get emails from them. I really don't care about that. This is optional, so I'm not going to enter it. So now they want me to verify. Um, what I'm going to do now then is uh, check my email. And there you see uh, email from logmein.com. So now I'm going to, uh, I, I set up my email ahead of time to view it so that it would save time for you. So here we go. I'm going to use this to log in and verify. Okay, so now we are verified. And we can log in. Okay, this, uh, this part gets kind of tricky, um, because what they're going to try and do is when you add the computer, it is, uh, it's going to be under the trial account as opposed to the free, continuous free one. So what we have to do, unfortunately, is add the computer, and then we're going to have to remove the computer and then add it again under free and I'll show you how here in a second. So we're going to download the application. I'll just download it to the desktop. <clears throat> and now I'm going to go ahead and install it. I'm going to go ahead and attempt to install it anyway without doing that. Of course, I um, that's going to be the description for my PC name. And here, you want to verify and make sure that you use log me in free.
this this may allow us uh, to use the free uh, access as opposed to the um, personal trial version. They are kind of tricky and they sometimes get you to use the, the trial one instead and then in hopes that you'll buy the application later. But they do have a continuous free one as well. So I'm going to pause this video while this installs. Okay, it is now complete. So after the, it's installed, we're going to click Installation was successful. And yes, as you see, my product is the free product. My computer is called Martin. That is my name. Now that would be my home PC. You can add other computers under your account as well. All you have to do is on the other machine, log in under your account. Mine would be the log me in at help video, help via video com, And then you would click add computer and ensure that you choose the free one again. I'm going to skip the installation here. Uh, I'm just going to show you how it works. Uh, basically, I will be administering, remoting into this PC remotely, but I'm actually already on this PC. Okay, so here we go. Uh, I'm not sure what will happen here because I'm actually on this machine, but I just wanted to show you how it will look for you uh, remoting in. So you can open it in a new window, or you can open it within this window being this tab here uh, I'm going to click remote control you're attempting to con remote control a PC at which you are sitting um, yeah it can cause a problem to do that uh, it would probably cause a mirror effect continuous mirror um, so I'm gonna I'm gonna not do that but that that was that would be how you would do it from a remote machine say you're at your friend's house and you want to access your home PC you simply log in to help via video dot com or you log into logmein.com and it will pull up this web page right here and as long as you have this application running which is your log me in then you will see Martin in session if you turn this off uh, with disable or exit log me in then you will you'll see this as machine turned off and you will it'll be grayed out and you won't be able to uh, remote into it and that basically in a nutshell is how to remotely access your home machine using logmein.com thank you for viewing our videos at helpviavideo.com thank you